We're seven matches into the season. We're three points off the top with Mets, but we are on uh, on the heels of a win at home against Bastia. We need to improve our defense a little bit. Journeyman, it's our fifth season since we started a save with no playing experience or coaching badges. And I feel like being in charge of St. Etienne after uh, just four seasons of play is not bad. We've won a trophy every year, so I'm really hoping that we can keep that going this year by winning a league title and getting St. Etienne back into the top flight of France where clearly it belongs, you know. Did I fix the scouting stuff? So apparently, as if you're on the player's page and you click the scouting on that page is where the issue is. But if you like... If you like click on the player and scout them that way, that's where it's not. So we're going to test that out today. But I did talk to some people about it. Oh, yeah, we brought in Martin. We brought in Mario Martin. Very happy that we have three midfielders that we like actually adore. Okay, so please be good, Saidu Torre. <laughs> Name of the game. Please be good, Saidu Torre. I believe in you, Saidu Torre. All right, I expect a win. For, yeah, the 49ers do look a tad vulnerable, but I think they're, they're, there are levels to the game, and I think every other team in the NFC, including my Buccaneers, is a full level below them. Toure! Oh. The coaches were brothers the last time those two teams played, and one of the brothers is still coaching there. Fun. Let's get back in the saddle here. Come on. Come on, boom, goal. Dang it. And the cross again. Shelter up. Bro like, really? Really? Re 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 so, yes, he's attacking mid, but he was also like the deepest guy on the play. Oh, that was good pressure. That's good pressure. Just got cooked. What is that line? Are you joking me right now? Ooh. It's all, it's all cohesion right now. Trust the process. We'll get there. This is just a day where the uh, cohesion bit us super hard. But it's it's the cohesion. Uh, like, that's just cohesion. We have very poor cohesion. Team barely knows each other's names. Can't play well together right now. We have to improve. Let's start tomorrow. That wasn't good enough, and we'll we'll start tomorrow. We're still third in the league right now. Commu you know, community outreach, match uh, reviews, and team bonding sessions so that everybody learns everybody else's name. We can play well together. Everybody understands assignments and what they're supposed to do. And uh, yeah, everybody everybody becomes friends. We're just getting into the teeth of the season. So we've got, you know, 30 matches left in the league. We haven't played a Coupe de France match yet. We've got our team together. We had a wild, uh, a wild west of a transfer window that we survived. We did survive the transfer window. Blessed be thy window. I cooked so hard for that train. I grinded. I grinded that transfer window. It was brutal. We did not get our first option often. But we did get somebody. And we like, I mean, it was a transfer window where you basically had to sell your entire team because they didn't want to be here anymore and then bring in a new team. And those windows are just inherently difficult. Okay. <clears throat> Focus, guys. God, come on. Focus. I'm going to come out in positive. Mellow bad boy. All right, we just needed to scale our defense back a little bit, be a little less aggressive with our defense. Stick to the plan. Be patient. Well, I have faith in you. This is an important match. After losing 3 0 in the last match, this is important. Might I update my training video in the near future? Uh, we just haven't done the work on training this year. Well, if that's not a penalty, I don't know what it is. Uh, I had to 
let go of the guy that was like doing that stuff. And so we don't really have the apparatus to like study training this year in the same way. I would love to work with um, EBFM at some point. We've talked about it. We just haven't set the time aside to do it we, when it comes to training. Thank you. I wish it was this easy for me to score this type of chance. My guys always fire it into the somebody that like blocks the shot. That was a beautiful shot. Not a great second half. It's been pretty lukewarm. Um, defense has been okay, but we have not shown the same creativity. Nice. Nice. Shut her up out of the middle because Diallo wasn't having a particularly good game. That is absolutely audacious, my man. Oh, let's go. Great little look. Ramsey, nice cut. Just an abysmal shot. <laughs> Just totally shanked it. Well, we've had an opportunity to really grab a hold of the league. We have not done that yet with a draw there, but the top of the league is not running away from us while we struggle and sputter, so that is a good thing. I mean, you know, Maxime Rodier. Oh, is we found the cap on Maxime Rodier's potential. Interesting. Dude was in the reserves when we got here. Clearly was first team ready, though. We just bumped him up. All right, and Babu's in. Um, Ramsey needs a week off after that groin strain that he suffered. And managed to play through. Lorenzo Sade gets his crack at attacking midfield, but we do have Efcon Bakiralu available should we need him. All right. Let's get back in the win column now. That being like two shots, 0 0.03 XG. That is okay. All right, Toure. Oh, nice turn. That would have been something out of nothing from my cafe. Lay it off. Good. Dean. Bravo. Van Bauman. Oh. 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 And we are going after the win at Dijon. Please, somebody find a goal here. And that is ours. Okay, cool. Luca, sweet Van den Bauman. Oh, it's Gasol. He was, I, I, he was off, wasn't he? Yep. Very close for Gasol, but I love the finish. I love the feeling of seeing my striker hit the ball into the back of the net. That is a nice feeling. Oh, all right. Well, we're progressing the ball pretty well. Rodier, we're going to get a chance to get this ball in one more time, looks like. Just kidding. J just kidding. We're going to make the dumbest possible decision. We're going to play a contested ball to the top of the box instead. And some missed opportunity to gain points on these teams. Right? They, 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 nobody in this league is grabbing it by the horns, right? I mean, we've got only five wins from ten, and we're in fourth place. Right, three draws, two losses. This league is just cannibalizing itself right now, and we're just sitting in the middle of the turmoil, quietly trying to figure out how to get our team to click. Ugh. Boy, we need a win. Just in one of those moments, we need one guy to make a play, and we have not had that guy. Need to be a little more aggressive, I think, with our rotation in this instance. Like, giving Shelder up a start consistently when he's just not delivering. You know, maybe throw out Maxime Rodier for a match. Fcon back in the lineup helps because our best run of form of this team so far was with Fcon in the lineup. And he just played in that last match and played a reserve match, so he should be fit enough to give us a full 90. 
your drop from this. I want Mbabu and Scales both available. Our team find its own way here. What opportunity they feel like is the best. We need a win. We need a win. We need a win. They maybe aren't guaranteed. If that match draws, they are. Because then Ghana would have two points. Oh, get in! Yes! Oh, it's a scramble. And it's Calvin Ramsey to put St. Antion in front. Yeah, the Zealandism channel is up. You can find it in the description of the video from today. You had Comoros upsetting Ghana on the final day to knock them out. Red cards everywhere. Equatorial Guinea. Equatorial Guinea is in its second consecutive knockout stage at AFCON. Like, don't sleep. You know? The interest in the afternoon window. That's a red. Get that out of the game. Get that straight out of the game, honestly. What are we even doing here? This is absurd. But they aren't starting AK-47. But Moritani had played two good competitive matches early, and this is AFCON, dude. Goal! You've got AFCON, and you've got AFCON. Both balling out right now. Welcome back from injury, sir. Oh, my goodness, Gasson. Oh, what a play. Shelter up gets him back. It's Evan Gasson. What are you doing? What just happened? Goal! Trust the plan. Trust it. You're hanging out there. You're going on support. You're going on what? Shelter up. It says you can play here. All right. I'm not making this up. You just run around like a madman. All right, you do your thing. And all right, fullback on sport. Ramsey loving it. Shelter up, extra pass. It's Alvaro. It's Gasson, and it's over. Dude, I got to order my sandwich for lunch because I have not gone to the store, and I need to go to the store. Nice work, everybody. There we go. There's the Sammy. Got it. All right, we're still, Matt's won, so we're still five points off. Oh, it's time to play the team that offered us a job. Awkward. The team that tried to hire me, but I decided to take St. Etienne and said, and honestly, they're in 15th and we're in fourth, so doesn't look like I made the worst decision now, does it? But whatever. How's Knock Breda doing? Uh, we actually haven't checked. I mean, I didn't want to check too early in the season because – you know, a few results into the season. They are uh, not bad. 12 matches in, 13 points, 15th in era of Izzy. Robert Soldrikis does have four goals on the season. So he's still the Tammy Abraham is here on Ajax. Nice. Richarlison's on. A Brother. All right, Lorenzo said, please give me something special here. I'm going to drop Toure for one match. We're just going to go with Lelama the bad boy. Okay, bad boy gets to start. It's part of our rotation to try and find something that works on that right wing. No, I mean, there's a reason we took over St. Etienne. They, we, we're getting paid five times as much as Nock Breda. <laughs> five times. Oh, have it. Oh, have it. Oh, baby. Oh, let's go, baby. I'm not seeing it with bad boy. I am. I'm seeing it. This has been a vintage bad boy match. He gets the ball. He's aggressive. He attacks the net. He's forcing turnovers. Uh, with his defense. Oh, Lorenzo Sade. It's bad boy. Goal! Are you seeing it now? Are you seeing it now? Do you see the vision now? This team should be winning the league. 100%.
I, I'm still ba I still back us to win the league. I've not changed our goals in the slightest. But you know, we've got bad team. We've got the highest uh, wage spend in the league by a mile. You know, we're the biggest club in this league. We uh, we've got the most money in this league. We should be winning the league. But we also just got relegated and had a bunch of guys that didn't want to be here, so we let them leave. And we've rebuilt this team, and this team just needs a little time to gel. But it has the quality to win this uh, to win this going away. Honestly, Mets Mets has won a couple matches in a row. They got that five point gap. But yeah, we're tied with the team in second right now. God. Eric Espos Exposito saying, "I playing time. I it wasn't promised." Uh, looks like I'm leaving then. Cool. I know it's November, but it's always hunting season in Saudi Arabia. Anybody? Al Ali? Oh my, that is just comical. That is just comical. The, the, the one instance where Esposito would all of a sudden become involved in the team just hit the day after. It's making slow but steady progress. We have international duty after this, so Alvaro Rodriguez, both of my strikers. This is a joke. On the first, my third string striker who hasn't even made the bench all year comes to me and goes, yeah, I think I want out of here. I'm not getting my promised playing time. And then on the second, my starting striker goes out for three weeks. And on the fourth, my backup striker's out for one to three days and may not be fit. Okay, I think Gasol is going to be able to play. Alvaro's definitely gone. Uh, fine, shelter up. Guess what, dude? You're playing striker. No way, that's crazy. Maxime, <laughs> yeah, you're in. Okay, let's go right back and let's go. Bungani Kumalo, center back, right back sub. Get him back involved on the bench. Okay. Everything else is set. FCON's back in the lineup. International break after this match. Let's go into it with a win. Let's go into it feeling comfortable and confident. We're at home against Avalencien. Well, that hurt. That, that definitely hurt. Also hits differently because I am starving. I had a waffle for breakfast and a uh, meetings, and then <laughs> kicked the stream on. Oh, let's go, Afcon. Vanden Bowman. Oh, oh yeah, and he's off. Well, at least it looked good. All right, Dane, good. Vanden Bowman, good. Martine. Good pass. Look at that. Yes, it's Lalamella bad boy again. Who's offside again? Joke of a call, by the way. Absolute joke of a call. But, you know, who's keeping track? Now we're going to get more aggressive. He's off again. Give me a third disallowed goal. And guess what? We drew. 1.8 XG, three disallowed goals that don't even count towards the XG. Africa Cup of Nations teams named. Yeah, baby. You know what that means? It's time to look for Wonder Kids. Starting with the Ghana team, and we're just going to look for guys that are of a certain age profile, like Lorenzo Sades on this national team. So we already got one guy signed up from there. Niger, two guys, sweet. All right, Toure's suspended, so all of the bad boys back in. We're going to go with a bit of a rotation, get some other guys some playing time, Lima and Kumalo. Yes. Okay. We are playing a non-league team. We are playing a team from the depths of uh, the depths of France. I expect, even though we have fully rotated 
a completely dominant performance. Stick to the plan B. I mean, look at this field. I think it's gotten better. Uh, I remember back at like FM14, it used to. Oh, that's pretty. And it was on. That is pretty. Amugu to Maxime Rodier. I, yeah, I'm, I'm not exactly, we're not on fire at this stage with uh, St. Etienne. Now, will we be eventually? Yeah. I think I'm a really good coach, you know, in this game. I think we'll get the thing going the right way, but it certainly didn't strike the right chord immediately. You know who always strikes the right chord? Lella Mella bad boy. He always strikes the right chord. Dennis Kagan. Guess who? It's Lamella Bad Boy. Oh, that was lovely from Kagan. Evan Gasson, it's 3 0. See you later, losers. Just kidding. You guys are doing great. Good job making the seventh round. Yes, it is. Like against league, do a competition relative to you're like playing a fifth division team. You're kind of just getting sharp. That's a nice header. Thank you. Please miss it. It's Giovanni Dos Santos. It's not. Go meditate and find yourself and the person you were trying to pass to as well. That, yes. Couldn't have said it better myself. Next round of the French Cup. All we needed. Beautiful. Well, that was fast. When does this go through? Uh, oh, it's immediate because it's like a domestic transfer in the Joker window. So Eric Exposito, the 31-year-old Spaniard, is on the move to Cannes for 750000 He's on the move. Okay, good. Okay, so Vandenbauman there. Lola Mella Bad Boy has improved his expectation. Ramsey... Okay, sweet. Not attacking, and they are playing a 4-3-3, a very straightforward one, with the exception of Anderson Lukoki, who is going to be sailing forward, and we will be on the lookout. Away against Quingam. Go out there and prove the media wrong, boys. Let's go! If I have a suggestion on a pre... What in the hell just happened? Oh, he just um, zipped that one right through the arms of uh, Claudia Ramos. Cool. Ramsey. Oh, it falls for Rodier. On to FCON! Rodier. Yeah, let's go! I don't even know what that celebration is, but it feels cool. There are three minutes left in this game. How much money do you have on the game for them? Just hit it away. I don't want to play out of the back anymore. Just send it. The hell are you doing? Dude. You're 35. This is the thing you shouldn't be messing up. You should have lost a step, not your brain. I actually actively sabotaged. I don't I don't I've never seen back-to-back -back passes from a goalkeeper that bad. I mean, we've actively been sabotaged. He's never playing again. I mean, legitimately, I'm never playing him again. Uh, we have a decent third string who's going to be on the bench now. I'm never playing him again. He's never getting anywhere near the team. He's broken. I hope he finds success somewhere else. He has cost us two points if we don't score in the next minute and a half. All right, boys. Who wants one? Who wants one? Shots all around. Hell yeah. Let's freaking go, dude. Vanden Boomen 
with no time left. All the things that I said are still true. He is never playing for me again. Ever. Nice. And just play it. Play it. Look for Branko. Absolutely ridiculous from Claudio Ramos to make us have to earn that. It's a month for shelter up. He damaged his kneecap. He's out a month. So it is not, it's not a short one. Claudio Ramos. Um, where, hold on. Where is he? I, I have, I have a request. I'm going to go to my second team. I'm going to find that goalkeeper that I don't hate. Uh, Bubakar fall. I'm going to bring him up. And Claudia Ramos, I am sending you down. That's it. That's my final decision. So enjoy your time in the B team. Uh, Bubakar Fall is going to be our backup goalkeeper. Uh, Zach Steffen is going to step in there. And that's it. And we will never utter his name again. He tried to lose me a game. I watched it with my own eyes. You can't convince me otherwise. He tried to lose us a game. All right, Alvaro Rodriguez is back, but we're hitting a nice run of form with Gasson in the lineup. So, Alvaro, you're off the bench for now. So, on uh, you. So. All right, uh, Yusuf Ait Benasser. How you doing? Just uh, keeping track of you a little bit. Oh, score it. The oh, have it! No! Oh, bad boy falling it into the post. It would have been an assist from his South African teammate, Bangani Kumalo, too. Oh, Maxim Rodier. Vanden Bauman. Rodier. There's Guess. Oh! Sifu play! And Mbabu's got all that wizened experience. All those years, the sweet the Swiss national team. So we're gonna bring him in. Hopefully that helps us see the game out. Uh yo! Let's go, dude. Big moment for Saidu Toure. How am I still in third, dude? My we have been unable to like crack the top two. Oh, look at Gasson. Oh, look at Gasson! Oh, look at Evan Gasson! Oh, well, I guess we've got our new starting star. Holy God. Well, I mean, we're saving on clean sheet bonuses. We do still have a two-goal lead, but what a hit. What a waste of this goal. Huge goal up the pal. Uh, you know, I, I respect the fan. I respect the fandom, Fargus. I do. But it's 3-1 to St. Etienne today. And a nice work and a good win. And we are moving on up. We're, but we're not because, you know, so we just, I don't know. <laughs> we have like a mental block when we, you know, when we're trying to get into the top two. Oh, sweet. Our next Coupe de France match. Against a team from the sixth division, an amateur side. We will rotate heavily. Ivan Alvej. 61 to $87 million value. Oh my goodness, that's a lot of money. That is a lot of money. We really found ourselves a monster, didn't we? I would definitely make a journey about myself, a video about myself if this journey happened in real life, yes. Three years in South Africa, a year at Nock Breda, a tournament, you know, a trophy every year of the career. This is legend stuff right here. We're on a legendary run. All right, Kagan, the slayer of bad teams, is here. This is your chance, Alvaro. Show me something. We're playing a team from the sixth division. You're from the Real Madrid Academy. There's only five subs allowed for this. Did I just mess that up somehow? Oh, we wanted fall. Oh, uh, sorry. I should I should have given fall a game. We can sub him in at halftime if things are going well. Free fall.
We're free and fall, baby. We're subbing him in right at the start of the game. Bubakar fall from St. Etienne's reserve team. Oh, good God. Amugu dropping a dime. Saidu Toure. Akomye. Amugu! Oh, no! Among Us. Some people say that game's dead. He's just getting started. Alain Diallo, well done. We're in the armband today at 19. Alain Diallo. Alain Diallo. It's Toure. It's surely Toure. It's Sainu Toure. And it's 2-0. And I feel comfortable with key highlights. And that would keep Ivory Coast on the hot seat going into the final match day. They might be eliminated too. Oh, Diallo. Oh, my goodness. Diallo. Goodness gracious. Koulibaly, Rodriguez, Mbabu, Diallo, Diallo still, Kagan, Dennis Kagan. The teenager in the captain's armband, the academy product, Diallo, leading his troops to victory today. That's harsh. That was a wicked deflection. That's harsh to be mean to fall there. I'm more that they scored at all. Diallo. Alvaro. Okay. They we're playing an amateur side. We're winning 5-1 at halftime. It is impressive they made it this far because last round we played a fifth division side. And now we're playing a sixth division side. And it's Kagan right off the kick. And it's six. Dennis Kagan. To addicted playing. Well, welcome back and congratulations. Thanks for supporting the stream with $5 of Jeff Bezos money. And same to you, E tight. Oh, that's a pen. I mean, there's only one answer. Bubakar fall. I want to be a giant Bubakar Fall fan, but you were made. Did you just try to paninka this poor man? Like, I've actually, it, I've never missed a penalty in any co ed league, like, penalty shootout. Ever. I have, I have a perfect penalty record that I am quite proud of. Oh, kid, yes! That counted. Elaine Diallo, he deserved a second. He has a second. It's 7 1. No, they, they the keepers are always trying to read your hips. I keep the feet straight and I run up and I drive the top of my foot through the ball. And sometimes that means it goes left. Sometimes that means it goes right. I have no idea where it's going and I don't line my body up in a way that gives away either side. I run up and smack the bejesus out of the ball with the top of my foot through it. And it just, no, most of the time it goes right top shelf down the middle. Oh, who do we play now? A semi pro team. From the fifth division. This Coupe de France thing is easy, dude. <laughs> Stream heritage. I get bamboozled. Yeah, this is a rough clip. This is a rough clip. I get destroyed by a young... Okay. He got me to bite initially. That guy was really nice. I heard Crocknaldo. Yeah, his name was Crocknaldo. That was when we did the charity stream at um we did the charity stream at South Bronx United. Little Mellow Bad Boy leading the training charge. Vibes are terrific. And we play Mets away in League de But I unfortunately have a meeting in three minutes. So we are not going to be able to play this match today.